Welcome back, YouTube, to another video. Once again with the 480p, um, this time a little bit different. I once again have my new attire on. For some reason, this hail strand does not want to be there for whatever reason. It's just, I don't know. The, Anyways, let me switch over and fix this mess real quick. So it's okay. Bit of screen. Unlock you, lock you, and bring you all the way down to there, I guess. It looks odd in 480, but I'm going to see what happens. Oh, well they... New update launched not too long ago. I finally got myself to uh, Tempest, which took forever. Also seeing how my mic does when I'm not right next to it. So that's fun. Ah, that's better. Okay, this is Saber Simulator. New update, you can jump multiple times, new eggs, took out the Halloween eggs, added new people, and yeah, added this, I can go over here, and Spend. I did not want to do that, but oh well. Okay. I need 10 more to make it, uh, forget, radioactive or what's after golden. I don't remember. And let me fall down here. More sabers. I'm all the way down here, and I need 73 S. Small S, mind you. Whoops. I need 5.821 big S to the next one. And I was on this one, so that's fun. Uh, let me kill this boss very quick. Instead of Warcraft, uh, farming, I'm going to test it, the settings of OBS in Roblox. Because why not? And just to show off the new update, you get multiple boss hits now, new badges that you can spend your money on, more pets as I said. Well, that guy has 420. Wow. 420 kills. That's a lot. But really, it's just me sitting down, just talking with a game in the background. Uh, the channel is going good, despite that I make a muck of things. By muck I mean I have stepped away from reading my blog posts from my website or Instagram and just speak from the mind at that moment. For the most part, 
it's it's okay because it's more energy rather than the script. However, <clears throat> at the same time, I feel like I'm not doing my best. I could be doing better. Uh, then again, how when you are doing your mission, therefore you are doing it the best you can at any given a moment which means how can you improve that sure you can improve your speech capabilities but uh shrug because i am speaking clearly i am getting my thoughts across but I am at a higher level than everyone around me, so I get comments like, Oh, you're insane, or your butt hurt, or you're a loser, get with the program, or go... Mm, what, what, what's the one where they always talk about Jesus? Go to Jesus. Uh, yeah, it's either... Save your sins by going diseases or something. Uh, so, for the most part, I feel like I could do better. However, at any given moment, since you are doing the mission, your great work, though for you are doing the best you can at any given moment, though for improvement is rather difficult. The only thing I could do is, again, that arc idea, the cinema in a new direction, then speaking organically from the top of my head. However, have you noticed this? Your brain, your mouth, works faster than your hands. Therefore, speaking normally about any given argument, aka topic, you're better off speaking about it than to type about it because my hands can only go so fast. I do not have natural dragon speaking technology, voice to text, I do not have any of those. And quite frankly, why not does it make a video on that subject anyways rather than put it to text from voice voice to text it doesn't make much sense to me because you're already speaking therefore just make a video on it into your microphone mind blown like like does this kind of hit me it's just like i don't really need a voice to text program software whatever i don't need it because i'm already doing this so yeah uh really okay so i just need a few more boss kills Or, yeah, I'm just gonna do this. Okay, that will help. Okay, about that real quick. Waiting on bosses. Need to be spawned about. Oh, I forgot. I can do that. Okay. Yeah, voice to text. Just make a video or speak into audacity or something that records voice if you do not want camera so th the only direction I can go with upon improving my blog vlog if you will is PowerPoint presentation or open document presentation or 
showing the actual blog post that you're reading from or show the photo you were reading from so there's like really four things or make a cartoon like Foamy the School has done or Super Planet Dolan or I think that's what it's called now he rebranded it um so those machinimas slash cartoons and make a video on the topics but through characters that you're voice acting for again cartoon slash machinima these are really the only way to go because I am already doing the best I can at any given moment upon organically speaking from the mind at any given moment now for some reason I have stayed with this just speak from the heart speak from the mind speak from the soul show the trances speak from that meaning speak record the visions that come up from the light language uh, soul language stuff so yeah it's like what is this yeah speak normally uh, clever less scripty but I still read my blog posts when I can meaning when I want to but right now it's just been off the top of my head no writing required just speak and you get to feel my energy better well as a script monologuing it uh, doesn't really showcase the aura that well however some people liked it others have not and I just go with whatever uh, but I should get back to my blogs and read more I started from blog post one did a did a PowerPoint presentation and made a video from that way however the concept that I keep thinking of or idea for a cartoon video machinima is okay you are seeing a noob go up to this priestess meaning I'm the priestess so that's kind of like my main character uh, of myself basically so the noob goes to this priestess he somehow the noob gets talked into going to this um, this location he goes up to this uh, priestess and asks how do you something something I have not figured it out yet except that's kind of the idea a noob comes up with or like how do you pre make a noob on the spirit path like that's the idea I have a priestess I have a noob on the path who was wanting to learn but I have not figured out the script that's basically all I got right now is that and well it's kind of like from Nixium's noob except is on a spiritual path therefore it's harder to uh, make because I don't really know how a noob would go about it like all I have is the, a noob would normally ask what is the meaning of life but a, an awake person would ask well would come up with why do I exist what is my purpose and therefore when they find that answer 
they do the great mission, the great work. They understand why they are on Earth at this time, in this moment. Why they reincarnated when they did. But that's from a awake person versus a noob. But yeah, that's kind of the the idea I have for a. Cartoon educational spirit blog. That's like the only new direction I got. I know anime has hidden nuggets here and there, uh, but not that much. But it's more common in anime than Western cartoons. Oh, I. Sorry, most of the Western cartoons died. Oh, I'm talking like. Uh, cartoons like um, not on Cartoon Network, not on Disney. Uh, well, technically, it is a Disney Channel, but it was called a Disney XD. I forget what it was called before that, but I'm talking about shows on that channel. Oh, Nicktoons, which don't exist anymore except for SpongeBob, and that one never had spirit knowledge. So, yeah, I'm not talking the reality cartoons. I'm literally talking like a SpongeBob cartoon because it's not built around reality on Earth. We're talking. Uh, I'm trying to think what would this one cart Nicktoon was called, but I I can't. So the only one that comes up right now is Invader Zim, Fairy Odd Parents. Uh, the only other one I can't think of the name, but two of them because it was on the other Nicktoon channel, which showed reruns of like old cartoons that no longer exist. Uh, the character name is Mikey. However, I can't think of the freaking. Cartoon name. Uh, purple. His, his best friend is a big. He wore a blue shirt, and his hair was, I think, blue as well. I think I don't remember. Yeah, good good luck on that one, brain. Uh, then there was the other, uh, but that was on tsunami, which is again anime. So, yeah, anime has more chances of spirit nuggets. Um, however, I knew this one cartoon just showed up, Ruby and Genlock, which is both from Rooster Teeth, however that's not anime from Japan, that is a western cartoon. However, both of them comes up with hidden spirit nuggets, however it's more common in anime. So, yeah, there's not much in the Western Hemisphere. Uh, well, yeah. Not even UK has more spirit nuggets, I don't think. I could be wrong. However, I never watched UK shows, so... Yeah, what would I know? The only one I watched was... Um, Torchwood. That was UK, but there was no spirit nuggets and it got cancelled, so yeah. Um, what was the other UK that I watched? No, that I know about, but don't, never watched it. Um, yeah. If you don't know what phone booth plus doctor means, yeah, good luck with that. <laughs> Because that's all I got. I, I never watched that UK show either. Um, but yeah. Spirit nuggets are hard to come by in the Western world. It's mostly found in uh, China, Japan, Hong Kong, uh, uh, other areas like that. So their culture is more um, active with spiritual beliefs, but also 
Russia has one. The space program is built around it, which is uh, just look up that again. Found from ancient alien uh, show, which uh, talked about it. I already completed. Well, you're about. Um, never mind. But yeah, that's kind of what my thought is on the whole new direction. What could I be doing better? As for aesthetics, aka lighting, uh, audio, resolution, um, the audio is fine because I have Blue Yeti now, my mic. Plus the whole new update they came out with uh, that I downloaded. So my mic is set. I have voice meter banana to help with the audio um, to make it, I forget what it is, something about bass, I think. Um, I don't really remember, but it, it, it helps with the audio, make it more likable, I guess. Uh, I don't use any audacity effects on it. I tried and it failed, <laughs> like failed. Um, I didn't like what was going on with it. So as I said, eh, no edits whatsoever, except for voice meter banana, which does, does something to the bass. I think, I don't really remember. Uh, lighting, I can't do nothing about that. Can't do anything about the my make it 1080 because I don't have a 1080 monitor, so I have to downscale to 480 from uh, 720, which was actually 1366 by 768 is my max resolution, which means I cannot go to 1080 unless I get a new monitor. Really, I just need a new PC because this is getting old. Uh, the life is almost up for the um, Microsoft thing. I think it has a, about either a year or two years left on the, the Microsoft life on it. So yeah, that's kind of what my thought is right now. I guess I need 370. 4M, I don't think I... Nope, 4.39 and 8. I'm just going to go to 8 and yeah. Oh, this is what <coughs> mm. this is the character I have now um, made her blue for some reason uh, the boots are different from her body outfit so I swapped out the boots and I believe I swapped out her 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 hands uh arm arms it, whatever it's just a mix up of stuff but yeah that's what my thought process is and I will go back to my other window Okay, just making sure it's in the right frame. So push this back, or push myself back. Okay, push myself back because I want my eels in the shot. But that's just about my 
thought process is right now, but also the end in note before I get super tired, because I've been doing that for two nights now. Not very good, but it, 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 it whatever. Something else came up, and it was just. 3D versus, yeah. So, I get up, right? She's already up. She comes up to me, says something. I don't respond, I just listen, and then I think it just makes sounds like, uh huh, or whatever. Uh, the, the sound. And then. I give a, a one sentence, but uh, then I I make her mad because I openly announce that I still want something, even though I already ate. So she gets pissed off, throws down what she was holding, and then she storms off. Then, a moment two later, I go back, sit in front of my computer, with a sulk, basically, not talking to her. Then, I say something else, or she says something, I don't really remember. And, the response I get is, you have been a bit this whole morning. Yeah, that's what she said to me. The fucked up thing is... Oh, now I remember. She was uh, doing something on the TV, looking at the guide or something, says, I should just shut it off. And I go, fine, shut it off. She gets pissed off, says, you have been a bitch this whole morning, what the hell is your problem? And I'm just sitting here like, what the fuck? I agreed with your ass, and you're saying I'm a bitch this whole time? And I just said nothing to offend her? She doesn't like me using the word stupid, she doesn't like me using cuss words, and today, I said neither. I, I didn't, did not cuss. I did not say the stupid word. And yet, I am once again being called a bitch. For no reason. Other than I got in her way. And... It's one of those moments where you just... You have to get away from this energy vampire and just scream, cry, whatever to get over it and and go what the fuck apparently my presence offends her just me being in the same room offends her Oh, it was fine before I moved out of my office. However, I could not stay in there because my hands were so cold, they were burning because they were that cold. I had to move near the heater, which meant move next to her again, even though I ver moved out of the room because I cannot stand her anymore. However, it's been like this for years, except I... The thing was... I could not use that office space because my uncle had to move back in. He, he was sick or something, had to move back in, and then he stayed here for like a year. Before that, it was a storage area, and first it was my bedroom, however, 
I had to move out when my uncle came in to move in and I'm like, no, I'm switching rooms, uh uh. And then it was a a storage area and I did not open that room for a long time until C wanted to do, I forgot what it was, but C had to use that room for something and it, it failed, but that's the only reason why I went back into that room because C made me help her again. Uh, asked for my help, I did it, and yeah. So years of waiting to get that room, I finally only go back in though, except right before winter and my hands were freezing to so cold, they were burning, so I had to move back out. Like, I wish I could have moved into that office space sooner, but again, my first it was my bedroom, then it was my uncle's bedroom, then he moves out, then it becomes a storage room, and I could not stand the smell because he smoked in there for like one day, and I could just smell the tobacco in that room, and it and his uh, body odor. Um, that's just, or his soap that he was using, or something, laundry soap, or uh, I don't know. Is this that room just stunk, and we didn't open it up until we had to use that room to for something, but it didn't work. We shut up the room again, and I said, "Okay, fuck this. I'm going to use it because you won't use it as a bedroom." Because my dad kept saying to me, oh, she could shut up shop in there or use it as a bedroom. She goes to me and like, no, I'm not using that as a room for myself. So, yeah, I'm like, fine, if you're not going to use it, I will. And you could have told me that sooner. Or whatever. But no. But before that was because, again... The room stunk, and the aura was still left over from my uncle, apparently. Maybe that is why I did not want to use that room sooner. I move into the room right before winter hits. got really cold outside. I had only used the room for about maybe five times. Only because I was sitting out here while the TV is waiting to watch something we recorded or whatever it was. Was it was usually wait for no one. So yeah. Now let's see the point. Well, okay, so my presence offends you. So I'm just going to lock myself up in that room again while it's freezing, while my hands and feet were burning because they are so cold. Or put up with her sit again until it gets warmer out and then move myself back into the office. It's like, really? Why do I have to put up with a person who literally hates my guts? for just being alive. Mind-blowing, really. Like, like, really? The kicker that I found, they, both of my parents are not my real parents. How the f- what in the world do I even mean? One, both of them are demonic, who is hiding as humans, except they are both demonic. Both of them have stunted my growth, prevented me from doing things as a light worker. 
I won't get into much details other than both of them do not support me. Both of them do not know that I have a YouTube channel or a website that I made or anything for that matter. I have to hide who I am, what I am, I have to hide every little thing because they will not understand. One is a Abraham religion, another is a, both of them are Bible Belt people. However, neither of them forced me to go to church and be baptized, only because when I was born they had no car. Or no, they had to get a car before they could take me home. Uh, so, yeah. I don't really remember that story other than all I remember hearing is no car. That's why they couldn't get me baptized or go to church. Uh, yeah. So, yeah, I live with Christian auras and I cannot stand it. They don't act Christian because they don't pray, they don't tell Bible stories, they don't, um, the one for dinner thing, I, they, they don't do any Christian activities, basically, and yet they were raised Christian. Both of them are baptized, however, I was not. Um, yeah, both of my parents are, in fact, demons. My soul is of the light. I am not human. I'm not immortal. I never saw myself as human. I always saw myself as royalty, a dragon, a dragon magic, angel, a uh, light being, light worker, star being. Rainbow Child, they have multiple names, neither of my parents are that, they are in fact the Devil's Spawn, and they have the nerve to call me that. My dad accidentally screamed it at my mother, take that hellion with you as he threatened to kick her out of his house by calling the cops on her. And yet, he doesn't remember saying that. We both remember we did not eat for three days because of what he said. She constantly throws, I am a bitch and my face when she is has a migraine and is severely pissed off at me like she was today and I'm just sitting here what the fuck me a bitch do you not Hear what you are saying to me, and you have the nerve to ask me what my problem is by saying what the hell is your problem, or saying, no, that's it. That's it. She has no idea why.
What did I just... Of course. No, never mind.